there, there are some uh, experts out there and, and people who read the tea leaves who would say that a future PM should have a stint in the Ministry of Defence as well. Uh -huh. uh, is that something that you, you believe and is that something that you think you might want to uh, look into in the future? Well, uh, the, 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 if we go by the logic of that, then you know, anyone uh, wanting to be the leader of the team will have to go through many jobs. And I don't think uh, that is the critical uh, point. I think the critical point is, at the end of the day, can we build a strong, cohesive team in Cabinet? Yeah. Build that trust and confidence within the team and with fellow Singaporeans to make sure that when it comes to decision-making, that we think ahead and that we're prepared to do the right thing and that we are able to gather the views of everyone and that ultimately under our cabinet system you know it is a system of collective responsibility and of course uh, you know at the end of it the pm would have to take the final decision so i'm very uh, uh, you know i very much appreciate the trust and confidence that my cabinet colleagues and my party uh, have uh, put on me to, uh, to lead them. Uh, so I will do my very best. And at the same time, I think I, I take uh, a great comfort that my colleagues think that, you know, if I have to be the person making the final decision, uh, that I'm the uh, most appropriate at this stage to lead them to take that decision.